These are Cuisinier rods. We can use them in a variety of ways to explore concepts in mathematics. One of the great things about them is that they have no markings on them. So we can work with the rods in relation to one another. One thing that we can do with them is build fractions. And we can also add and subtract fractions. In this case, what we want to do is we want to add two fractions that have unrelated denominators. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to write down an expression that reflects that. So here I have 2 thirds and I want to add 3 quarters. Now what I'm going to do to make it easier is I'm going to use some centimeter grid paper. Well, the first thing that I want to do is I want to build two-thirds and I'm going to use the grid paper to help me because this rod has a length of three and this rod has a length of two. So there I've built two-thirds. Now I want to build three-fourths. So I know that this rod has a length of three and then I'm going to use the next one that's a little bit longer and that's force. So here I have two-thirds and I have three-fourths. Now we do not have the same denominator so what we need to do is we need to think about building a common denominator. Well here's one thing that I know. If I add another three of these, I now have made twelfths. Now because I have added three here, I also need to do the same thing to the top. So now what I have is I have four of these green rods and I have four of the red rods. Now let's take a look at the fraction that I've built. This is 3, 6, 9, 12, so it's twelfths, and it's 2, 4, 6, 8. So I have built 8 twelfths. Now what I want to do is I want to make this one out of 12. So this is 4, and another 4 is 8, and another 4 is 12. And I know that they're equivalent because I can check the length. Now I added 2 here, so now I need to add another 2 here. And so I've gone from 3 fourths to, this is 12, 3, 6, 9. So now I've gone to 9 twelfths. And now I'm ready to add them together. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to take this and just move it down here. Both of these are twelfths. So what I'm going to do is I'm just going to take these blocks representing my numerator and I'm going to put them down here. So now what I can do is I can count these together. So I have three, six, nine, and another two is eleven. 13, 15, 17. So I have 17 twelfths. Now I know that that is an improper fraction, so I see that here's one whole, and then I have 2, 4, 5, another 5 twelfths. So I have 1 and 5 twelfths. And here's one way in which we can use the Cuisinier rods to add fractions with unrelated denominators.